Welcome to my pastor's study. Today we're going to look at uh, Matthew uh, cha uh, chapter 26 and 42 verse. What therefore ye know not what hour the Lord doeth come. Now again, again in Matthew chapter 26, 46. Blessed is that servant whom the Lord when he cometh shall find so doing. We don't <clears throat> know for sure when the Lord's going to come. It could be any day now. Uh, by the looks of the world and the things that's going on in the world today, it could be any time. It couldn't, can't be far off, as some of us think. Next, a few questions. What will the Lord find us doing? What will we be doing? How will we be living? How will we be acting when Jesus Christ returns? Will we be living a life that pleases him? Will we be faithful to him? Or have we gone astray? What will our condition of our life be? Will we be saved? Will we, or will we be lost? Christian, it's time to get your life in order. It's time to get right with God. It's time to serve him. Unbeliever, if you don't know Christ as your Savior today, it's time to repent. It's time to receive Jesus into your heart as your Lord and Savior. So when he does come, you can go home to heaven with him. If you have an unsaved family, friend or neighbor that doesn't know Jesus Christ as Savior. Now's the time to tell them how they can receive Christ and spend eternity with him. Paul tells us in Romans, tells us how. Puts it pretty plain and simple in Romans 10, 9 and 10. If thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus Christ shall believe in thy heart that God hath raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. For with the heart man believeth unto righteousness, and with the mouth confession is made unto salvation. Today is a day of salvation. Tomorrow could be too late. Thank you, and God bless you all. And have a very merry, blessed Easter. Thank you.